when publishing your work, you will be presented with an agreement stipulated by the publisher. The publishing agreement will generally cover the following information. When the work will be published, the format the work will be published in, printed or online or both, how many print copies will be made available, and if the author is entitled to any royalties, how they will be shared between the author and publisher, and when they will be paid, etc. Within a publishing agreement, authors are generally asked to warrant that they created the work and therefore they own copyright. If third-party copyright material is included, the author has the necessary permission from the copyright owner to include that material. And the work contains no unlawful statements, does not infringe the privacy of others, or contain material or instructions that might cause harm or injury. The agreement will also address how copyright in the work will be managed. Many of these agreements ask you to transfer copyright fully to the publisher, thereby restricting your rights to distribute and to use your own work, such as the inclusion of your published work on course websites, in scholarly presentations, on your personal webpage, or in HKBU iReams, and reusing the work in your teaching or your future research. Therefore, take the time to understand what you are signing away. As an author, you are entitled to negotiate certain rights with a publisher. This may include rights to deposit an open access copy of the work in HKBU iReams, with or without an embargo period, exemptions for teaching and educational purposes, and the right to reuse your figures, images, and tables in future publications. You may not always be successful in negotiating changes to your publishing agreement, but there is certainly nothing to lose by starting these conversations with your publisher. A compromise can sometimes be reached that can avoid the all-or-nothing scenario.